Imagine that you have the opportunity to learn a language that you are not able to speak now. Explain which language you would choose to learn. Give specific details and examples to support your explanation. Well, my mother tongue is Serbian, and the only foreign language which I currently know is English. If I have time to learn one more foreign language, I would choose to learn German language. First of all, I'm a mechanical engineer, and there are many jobs for engineers in Germany. If I one day decide to move to Germany and find a suitable job there for me, then knowledge of German language will help me a lot. Secondly, German language is not some unknown language. Many people around the world know to speak German. If I learn German language, then I will be able to communicate with many people around the world. For these reasons, I would choose to learn German language. There are many ways for people to stay healthy. Explain what you do to stay healthy. Give specific details and examples to support your explanation. I stay healthy by eating healthy and doing physical activity, in some respects. I do not eat junk food and fast food. When I do not have time to prepare an elaborate meal, I take whole grain cereal, like muesli, that is how I do not intake too much fat. I also never drink carbonated sodas saturated with sugar. When I need to go somewhere, I almost always do it by walking. I do not own a car, and in, and in many situations catching a bus would be a more prudent choice than walking, but I prefer to walk. So, these are a few ways how I manage to stay healthy. Describe an experience you had where you were faced with a conflict. How did you resolve that conflict? Include details and examples to support your explanation. One, one way how I make passive income is by giving private tutoring classes. During this, I was once in a conflicting situation. A student offered me some extra money if I, if I help him with some shenanigans, so he can pass a few exams without learning anything. I have done similar things in the past, but this case has irritated me. The student said to me that he has found some connections in one foreign company for a job and that, he, and that he has also collected enough money to give for the required bribe, which is not an unusual thing for the corrupted Republic of Serbia. Since I highly detest bribe, but I was also in need for money, I was in a conflicting situation. However, at the end, I chose to kick him out. For these reasons, that was a conflicting situation for me. Describe an experience you have had that illustrates the expression good things come to those who wait, and explain how the experience illustrates the expression. Once I had an opportunity to get a regular job in my corrupted home country of Serbia, but that required for me to give bribe. I generally detest any form of corruption and bribe in particular. I also did not have money for that. Even if I wanted to do that, I would have to borrow money from a loan shark and then spend the rest of my life giving half of my salary to him. And that would also make me join the corrupted clique at that firm. I decided to wait 
for some better opportunity. In the interim, I found some ways how I can earn passive income, sufficient enough for surviving. Now I'm doing things that I enjoy doing, and I'm planning to go back to school to learn other interesting things in science and engineering. I plan to be a student for the rest of my days. For these reasons, the mentioned experience illustrates the mentioned expression in the best way possible. What characteristics do you think make someone a good parent? Explain why these characteristics are important to you. Parents have to be responsible for their child. Successful parenting requires more than providing for the physical needs. It means being committed to children's developmental well-being and overall success. Encouragement is the first and foremost thing a parent must do. Life brings many failures, but learning to cope with them and being encouraged to move on is necessary. This goes a long way to boost the confidence and well-being of children. Parents have to be understanding. Understanding leads to a healthy and smooth relationship between a parent and a child. Parents should be so much approachable that their children can talk their hearts out in front of the parents. For these reasons, I think encouragement and understanding are the main qualities that a parent should possess. Do you think bicycles will still be widely used in the future or be replaced by other means of transportation? I think that bicycles will still be widely used in the future. Even more than that, I think their use will increase dramatically. Traffic congestion is already severe. It will, and it will become even worse. Cars may go faster, but they often don't get to desired destination quicker. Cyclists can make their way to the front at red lights, and when motor traffic ceases up, bikes keep going. Furthermore, in the future gasoline will become scarce, prices will go up, and not many people will be able to afford it. So more and more people will begin to ride bicycles. Also, people will become more environmentally aware. They will realize that corrupted conservative politicians are lying to them that the global warming is just a hoax. For these reasons, I think that bicycles will be widely used in the future. Does technology make our lives simpler or more complex? Give details and examples to support your response. At first glance, it may look like that technology is making our lives more complex. But that isn't true. It is the capitalism that is making our lives more complex and its desire to squeeze the last quantum of energy from us. First of all, there are endless numbers of tools and machines made possible due to technological advancement. All these machines have made our lives easier and more enjoyable, because those machines are doing repetitive humdrum and hard tasks instead of us. Also, technology has enabled us to learn new things easier. We can easily find information about the topics we are interested in, thanks to the internet. All kinds of computer learning programs are enabling us to learn things a lot faster. For these reasons, I think that technology is making our lives simpler. 